Hello everyone, today I want to share the ideas of the concept that what is ecology? Have you ever hiked through the forest and noticed the incredible diversity of organisms living together from birds to trees to mushrooms the size of the dinner plate? Or taken a road trip and watched the landscape change outside the window, shifting from oak forest to tall stands of pine to grassy plains? If so, you've gotten on the classic tale of ecology, the branch of biology that examines how organisms interact with each other and with their physical environment. So ecology isn't just about species-rich forests or scenic vistas though. Have you, for instance, even ever found cockroach living under your bed? If so, then you've seen equally valid examples of ecology in actions. One core goal of this sharing of ecology is to understand the distribution and abundance of living things in the physical environment. For instance, your backyard or neighborhood probably has a very different set of plants, animals, and fungi than the backyard of a fellow Khan Academy learner on the opposite side of the globe. So these patterns in nature are driven by interactions among organisms as well as between organisms and their physical environment. As an example, let's go back to our shower molds. Mold is more likely to appear in your shower than, say, your sock drawer. Why might this be the case? Maybe the mold needs a certain amount of water to grow, and this amount of water is found only in the shower. So water availability is an example of an abiotic or non-living factor that can affect distribution of organisms. Maybe mold feeds of dead skin cells found in the shower, but not in the dresser. Availability of nutrients provided by other organisms is an example of a biotic living organisms related factor that can influence distribution. Within the discipline of ecology, researchers work at five broad levels, sometimes discreetly and sometimes with overlap, organisms to bigger phase biosphere, from organism, population, community, ecosystem, and biosphere.